Day keeps the haters away. What's up, chat? <laughs> we back for another vlog. My gum, my gum is kind of um. It's kind of spicy. I've been chewing here for a couple minutes and it's still spicy as hell. Anyways, it's Monday. Just ended one vlog an hour ago. Now we're on to the next vlog. You really love to see it. Is this a cop? Why does it not have lights? Oh, you as park ranger. We got park rangers? Um, but yeah, it's Monday. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what I'm about to do with my life because I just took my sister and her friend that's a boy to the fashion district i was originally gonna go in there because um i'm gonna spit my gum out because i think it's so tacky to talk and chew but i was originally gonna go in there and like let them do their own thing but i was gonna go into primark and i really like the sephora fashion district because nobody goes to it so it's like always super clean and super stocked um and i forget there's like two or three like a good h&m in there never been in the primark there and i think they have like a carters or something in there so i was gonna go in originally but zoe fell asleep so that's fun so now i'm kind of like well what do i do with my life what's up bookie we home um we, we've been home and we're watching super mario's together for a little bit oh my god i got lip balm all in my nail i actually think <laughs> i actually think i'm about to drill the gel polish off my toes um so I can have a little fresh set for my B-Day. And then I'll probably draw off my nails at some point too. So I could redo them. Because I had to do them plain the other day because I was lazy. But I think I want to have a little, a little classy French tip. If I do say so myself. But anyways, I wanted to open some packages with you guys. Um, I don't think I ever showed you guys what ASICs I got the, what ASICs I got the other day at the store. Um, so I got these ones. These were like the only ones they had in my size, which was fine. I didn't want these ones. I wanted the ones that I got Harper, but it's fine. It'll do. Um, I think this is P. Well, I know it's PR because I didn't order that thing. But the box says Margella. Mason Margella. So let's see what they sent me. Super, super cute. They sent me um, replica Mason Margella from the garden. Hold on, my nose itches. This crisp fragrance combines notes of tomato leaf and green mandarin essence with gra geranium and pat pat patchouli <laughs> to recreate memories of a sunny afternoon spent in the garden. Okay, I don't own a perfume by them. I smelled a couple of them. Um, oh, they sent so many samples too. Um, I know a lot of people like that one is like by the firewood, by the fire. I don't know, something like that. I know they're like very distinctive smells. So let's see what this one is all about. I love how the box said Margiela. It's like, um, I need to edit last week's vlog. How cute is this little bottle? Discard before use. This is so stinking cute. I'm scared to spray it on me because what, like, what if it's like strong? Because tomato leaf, I'm ne I've never heard of that in perfume. It's not bad. It does smell like in the garden. <laughs> Quite literally, the names always match these. It quite literally smells like like a pretty garden, but there is something like a little bit of spice in it. Where did it say was in it? I don't know, but it definitely gives me garden. It is clean. I don't know. I don't necessarily think it's my kind of smell, but I think I might try it and like mix it with something. But it's drying down sweeter, so let's give it a second. Like when I first sprayed it, I smelled more of like the spicy garden. But now it's drying like clean and kind of soft. Sister also sent me their new shampoo and conditioner. Let me tell you guys, last week, well actually for like the last month or so, no matter how much I washed my hair, no matter what I did, what I scrubbed my scalp with, my hair just was continuously so oily and it had like so much buildup that I could wash it and blow dry it right away and my hair just was heavy and it just felt so nasty. So is that something on my face? So the other day I was like, no, like I want my like light, airy, healthy kind of hair like where it's a little bit bigger it's not as flat so 
I had to go on my stash. The necessary stuff, I find that it replenishes what needs to be there, but it doesn't add anything to your extra. You know what I'm saying? So, like, the shampoo gets it just nice and clean. It doesn't have a scent, so, like, there's no fragrances. And then the conditioner just adds the moisture and stuff back to my ends. Did that. As you guys will see, my hair is clean. You can tell how clean my hair is. Hold on, let me set this in. You can tell how clean my hair is when it looks more of, like, a little bit more poofy and has more body to it it's because there's nothing weighing my hair down right now they're so nice enough to send me the rosemary collection um first of all the packaging because i opened it the other day and i was like Ow. this green i've been really into green lately which is so not like me um but the green the green is cute i like it i was trying to smell it but there it is it, it has a nice rosemary and usually i'm not a rosemary type of girl but it almost smells like it's like a rosemary and rosemary and like mint combination um oh i'm trying to figure out how to put this back super super nice and then i got a package from garnier like who are we what's so cool is that they sent me the whole collection so they sent me the hair filler and bonding <laughs> inner fiber repair treatment this is a rinse out so step one hey Excuse you, sir. Step one, rebond. Step two, this is the shampoo. Step three is the conditioner. Step four, moisture repair serum. And step, well, not step five, but redefine is a leave-in gel cream for curly and wavy hair. Fill hair with moisture up to... Ooh. Ooh, I'm excited to try this. Good morning, everybody. It is Friday morning. I'm about to go make Zell some meat. I think I might actually just go get him some Dunkin' Donuts real quick because I think he ate all his pancakes. Um, but it's 10 o'clock in the morning, first of all. I usually go back to sleep at some point, like after I take Harper to school and then Mia ends up wake up at this time. I've been up all morning. I need to dermaplane my face because it's so hairy. Like when my tan is not visible, my hair is so noticeable. I'm mean, like, I noticed it, but you can't notice it under makeup. But let me tell you guys how today is the day the VIB sale started. And starting last night, because there was like three things I needed for the trip, which were a mini setting spray. And I wanted the, I wanted the milk one, because I really like that one. Like I go between the milk Fix Plus and the Hourglass one, but I prefer the milk over all of them. I still haven't tried the, um... The Patrick Star one, the one size beauty. But I don't really like continuous mist. I don't know. That's kind of just a preference for me. But anyway, so I was like, okay, I need a mini setting spray. And I ran out of my hourglass concealer. And I was like, well, I'll just wait till Friday and place the order. So I was placing the order. And I was like, oh, I need like a lip balm. Like, I don't know what none of my lineages are. You know, they're probably my purses. Um, so I was like, let me just buy. Look at all this hair that's come out. That comes out because I don't ever brush my hair. I just be vibing when my hair is out. Um, I was like, let me just buy everything in my cart. So mind you, I had like $700 worth of stuff in my cart. And it was basically all the same stuff. Like a couple skin tints, um, a lot of bronzing products, a lot of blush. Because that's kind of just what I'm into. I don't really go to Sephora necessarily for like, um, what's it called? Skincare or anything. You guys know, like my skincare, it's La Roche and stuff. If it's not broken, I don't fix it. I don't really get my hair stuff from sephora either i was replenishing my necessary stuff but that's about it for that and my way acv shampoo but other than that like i really only get makeup from sephora like when people are showing all this stuff and it's like other stuff i'm like how do y'all find this stuff but anyway so i had like 700 dollars worth of makeup to try and mind you like i really just wanted to get like my summer base together so like a couple primers but mainly blush and bronzers because i feel like it's so hard to find good bronzers and i'm always trying to told me to check my freaking thing cancel what did you cancel my order for so then i placed it again thinking if i tried a different payment method it'd work boom canceled within 10 minutes then i was like let me just go to the store tomorrow and buy the three items that i need like maybe i'm just being sidetracked and god is just saying baby you don't need all this stuff so i placed the order for like the four things that i was getting because i got like a backup concealer just in case the hourglass one like it sold out because it says limited stock or something I put that on a different card it went through it says processing but then i placed um the big order again for today for pickup with the same card that the order is processing on boom canceled i'm just like what the hell is going on not 
two percent. What my camera is always on. I'm like the worst vlogger ever. Please hold. All right, the hair is done. Not all the way done. Um, I just straightened my roots because I have to bump my ends. Put a little bump in them or whatever. I'm about to sit down. I'm about to go get harp in a second, and then run to pick up my um Alta and Sephora orders. I have to go to two Sephora's and one Alta. But it's all curbside. I'm going to see if Heart wants to go in and get some skincare. But we'll see. But anyway, so I want to come over here and talk about my birthday gift my best friend got me. So I don't really ever like necessarily like want things. But I do always accumulate like um wish lists. Let me take my retainer off. Hold on. Anyways, like I was saying. I do accumulate like wish lists. Basically just things that like I would like to have and I plan to buy myself. But I just don't get around to it or I just stall on it or whatever. So, obviously, Steph was like, oh, like, what do you want for your birthday? And I was like, I don't want anything this year. And, like, it's because I didn't want anything. And when I say, like, I don't want anything, it's just things that I plan to buy myself, but I don't I don't necessarily want to ask people for. So, anyways, I just was talking to her about this item that I want, and she was like, I'm going to buy it for you. And I was like, please do not buy it for me. Like, just because I felt like it was a big, a big thing, because, like, I felt like it was pricey. And because I don't know anybody with the product, I was like, I don't know anything about it. Like, I'll get it at some point. She's like, no, I'm going to get it. Next thing I know, she sent me a screenshot that it was ordered. And I was like, oh, crap, we're in it to win it. So I've had it on for a couple days. Let me just say, TikTok definitely was something that influenced... I feel like I'm using my hands a lot. TikTok was definitely something that influenced me a lot into this ring. You know why I'm using my hands a lot? Because I had a coffee and I don't know how to drink coffee. I start acting crazy. But TikTok was definitely something that influenced me with the ring because um, I don't sleep that well. So I wanted to be able to track my sleep. Um, you can use it for your cycle. It can help you, like, basically as a form of birth control because it takes your body temperature and your blood pressure and all this jazz. Um, and what else does it do? I ended up getting a size 9, and I'm usually, like, a size 7. And the reason I got a size 9 is because the size 8 fit me, but it was a little snug. I wanted the ring to fit me so that it was comfortable, like, so that I didn't really notice it. Um, and I also wanted to be able to interchange it on all my fingers. Like, I wanted to wear it on my ring finger, my index finger, my middle finger, my thumb even. I wanted that um, option. Sorry, is my TV loud? I'm watching Sex in the City. Like I told you guys, I'm on, like, season three already. One thing about me is I'm going to watch a TV show, child. Like... TVs that are you're binging don't even stand a chance. By the way, Zoe's in the bed being a menace to society. Um, I'm gonna put you guys on this table real quick because I'm tired of holding it. But yeah, so I ended up getting a size nine because I'm gonna show you guys. Um, I don't even oh the sizing kit is up there, but I don't even feel like getting it. So this is a size nine, like I said, and basically it just has a whole bunch of sensors inside the ring. If you're one of those people like, oh my gosh, they're gonna know everything about you. Apple knows everything about me. Like at this point in my life. My FBI agent knows everything about me. Like, I, whatever. I love a good little techie product. And I love everything an Apple Watch does. But I don't really wear my Apple Watch that much. Um, because I do feel like it's rather limiting. So, yeah. Anyways, it's a ring. It has a whole bunch of sensors. It has, like, grooves in it. But you don't feel it as much as you thought you would. So, like, my size 9, I could fit it on all of my fingers comfortably. Um, and I wanted to have that option just in case. You know, like, depending on my mood or whatever. So... What is he doing? So yeah, the groove that's at the bottom that goes inside your palm. What happened? You sleepy? You can take a nap. You woke up so early. Me and Zoe have been up all morning. Um, I will say, the ring cost, I believe it's like five something. What? You want me to lay down? Okay, hold on. Um, the ring costs like five something. I think it's like four ninety nine, and then by the time like taxes and all that are factored in, it's like five something. The ring is pricey, okay? Like, it is. I feel like it's pricey for a ring, but it's not pricey considering what it does. And I don't really want to cover too much on the app yet. I probably will like in a couple of days once all of my metrics and stuff are in. Because since I just started wearing it, it's still getting to know me too. Um, what happened? What happened? What ha okay, I'm going to lay down. I'm coming. Give me one second, okay? Okay, hold on. Mama, oh, you're so sweet, buddy. Um, okay, I'm right here. I am laying down. Okay. That's better. So, oh, oh, you just love your mama. Your mommy's baby. You're so sweet to me. But yeah. Oh, mommy is. Oh. Um. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right. Um. So it is expensive, right? So grateful to get it as a gift. But I did want to say one. One 
thing that I was very disappointed in with this freaking brand was the goddamn shipping. Now, it did say that it was going to take three weeks to come. Mine didn't take that long. I'm guessing it's certain sizes, maybe, certain styles. Um, I got my sizing kit in like two days, and then once I selected my size, I got the ring in like three days or something like that. So it wasn't too bad. The shipment, though, of like the packaging, I was so disappointed in the price. Like, I thought it was going to be something that was like this whole unboxing experience. It was not, okay? I'm going to show you exactly how it came, but I'm going to explain it. So anyways, I'm thinking that it was going to be like this, this like medium-sized box, like shoebox size, have like a box for your ring, the charger, like a cleaning cloth, an infotainment pamphlet. You know, I love me a good pamphlet. It didn't. So, I came in this box, okay? This generic cardboard box that has basically the skews and stuff on that so they know which one it is. Okay, cool. But this box did not come in a big box. This box was in a UPS, like, shipping bag. And they just, like, folded the bag so that it fit the box very tall. That was it. Like, they didn't even have a custom box with nice tape. Yourself. It didn't even have a custom box with custom tape or nothing. And like, it just like, remember that suitcase I got? Like, that's branding to me. Or like the skincare set, like, that's branding. This for $500, they could have, they they missed the ball. And I was very disappointed in that for the, the money. Even if you get the ring that is a little bit less, still, like, I should be getting a whole experience when I get this ring that makes me want to be in love with it. Literally, this box with a UPS bag. And the label inside of this box was this box as you can see nothing goes in this box it's a nice plain white box nothing fancy about it but you would open it um and then the charger was wrapped around here and then it had the charging like dock thing yeah the cord was on here and then it was the dock inside here and then on the dock was the ring like that's it i mean i didn't know open yeah i mean there is a pamphlet in here but like i don't even i don't even care to um read it at this point because like that's it like for 500 dollars that's all i get is this rinky thing box um like apple has better packaging like at least apple like puts the plastic still that you're like that you're like oh my gosh like this is so exciting open none that this white box inside that brown box and that's all you got uh look they got a pink dice in Mm, that smells kind of good. You like that? Smell it. You don't even smell it. You don't want it for your birthday? Oh, too bad. Right now ain't your birthday. Your birthday is next week. I know this ain't the line. Now I... The Sherry, this Sephora and Sherry Hill, don't ever got nothing. This smells good. Um, mm, this one smells good too. Hmm? It smells like what? My dance partner. This smells nice. Vanilla Vice. You love vanilla. Mm. Um, so, on today's episode of. What the f am I doing? You guys know I did my pickup order for Sephora and also at the fashion district because they're two next to each other. And I was like, oh, they're right there. I'll just pull up, get my stuff. I go to Sephora, it says they got curbside pickup. I click it, they're like, yeah, curbside's not available. I hop out the car and the door's locked. They're like, you have to enter through the mall. Are y'all waiting in line? Yeah, um, there's all this traffic. So I literally probably did circles for like 85 million hours to the point that I was literally about to cry. I keep telling Harper that I'm so excited to give her her birthday gift that I want to give it to her early, but I'm not. Oh, this is what I need. Hydrating gentle cleanser. Anyways, got the altar stuff. Now we're about to go to Sephora really quick. Hopefully this Sephora downtown does curbside because I don't feel like getting out the car. You know how hard it is to find a parking spot in this damn city? But, um... I feel like I was just looking at all the samples. They always have such good samples in the store, but like when you look online, they don't have none of them. And I was like, ooh, all of this stuff seems so nice, but too late. That store has all the cool sneakers. How cool is that? Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. Thank 
Oh, you're welcome. Where did my child go? You want another one? Yeah. Anybody help with the guys? Um, where's the Summer Friday stuff at? Summer Friday? Sorry. Oh, see? Yeah, Harp Day. When I tried to order it online, they didn't have none. You want that one? Thank you. Okay. I that one color. Never mind. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, I figured. Thank you. Um, is there another one you want to try? Who was it? You know who they said has a good one? Um, Kosas. It was a little recipe. Don't get tired. My a, friend broke out from yeah, this. Yeah, because it has asses in it. Don't. My friend tried this out. Broke it out. She looks horrible. I'm Thank you, Neve. You, you need that? Let me smell it. I heard that one doesn't smell that good. <laughs> Twin, where have you been? All right, now we gotta go to Sephora number two. Harper, she, at first she was like, I didn't want anything from Sephora. I don't need nothing. And then she got in there and started wanting things, but luckily she used her gift cards and not my dollars. Ain't that right, you paid like a big girl? You got $50 left on one gift card. Spend it wisely, sister. I don't know why it doesn't work. Go give it back to Harper. Go give this to Harper. I know. It doesn't work. I'm sorry, buddy. I don't know why it doesn't work. Okay. Um, Alright, let me show you. So we'll start with Alta because Alta is nothing really exciting. I got most of these skincare items because they sell mini La Roche's. So I got a mini moisturizer. And I usually just leave this one too in my makeup bag. So like when I'm doing my makeup, I have access to a moisturizer. Um, so I got the double repair. I think it's like $10. And then I got a mini hydrating gentle cleanser. This isn't my favorite thing by them. But I think I'm going to just use this up and then I'm just going to refill it with my regular. Or maybe I'll depot this one put my other one in this one so I have easier I could use it better and then I picked up the CeraVe foaming facial cleanser this isn't my favorite one either but sometimes like um because when I thought I was going to use this one it doesn't get makeup off that well so I just needed something to double cleanse so I just picked up these two um I got that and then I got a blush brush because I just needed something for like cream blushes because sometimes I use the angled brush and it's not like my favorite so I just picked up this one from Elf. It's like $3 and it's actually really nice quality. So I just needed something I could pounce that on. I don't like that word, pounce. Something I could put that on with. So I picked that up and then I just picked up a Juvia's Place blush. I just been trying to expand my blushes because I do light blush, but I only own. Like all the cream blushes I have, I feel like they look similar on my skin. So I've been trying to switch it up a little bit. So I picked up this one. This one was volume two. And it looks like, now that's what you call packaging, bubble wrap, okay? It looks like this. And I love how Juvia's, you get two colors. Yeah, everything's always so nice quality. So what's the matter, baby? Harp got two Laneige lip balms. She got a jar one and a tube one. She got um, peach. I never tried peach. I feel like it's the only one I've never tried. I got a Tower 28 concealer. I heard this concealer is really nice. I picked up 11. Um, no reason why. I feel like I'm pretty good at eyeballing things on the website for my colors. Um, I don't know why I'm always struggling. One in the shade 11. I believe it's like a, what did it say it was? A serum, so it's a little bit more hydrating. Yeah, so I picked this one up. I picked up, yes, I picked up the Yummy Skin Tint in the shade 8. If you guys remember last summer, um, my girl Leslie at Cherry Hill Sephora got me an 8. But I also think I could be a 9 too because they're basically both warm skin. I mean tan skin or medium skin but different undertones. So like depending on my tan, my undertones are kind of different. Like sometimes I'm a little more neutral and sometimes I do like a neutral base. Um, but sometimes I do prefer a warm. So I picked up an 8 because it just was a smidge lighter. I didn't want to go too dark. Um, so yeah, I got this for the trip because I do really, really like that. And I just always forgot to buy it full size. Um, Harper picked up the Kosas Dream Bean Sunlit Comfy Smooth Sunscreen. 
and it has like a golden shimmer in it. Um, I want to try this though. He said I could take it to Miami with me. I heard this was really, really good. You guys know I got another one of my favorite setting sprays, so I just wanted to give it a try. I'm not really into continuous mist, which is why I had never really tried it, but I'm sure it's a great product because I know Patrick knows what he's talking about. I used to love watching Patrick on YouTube. Um, so yeah, I just picked this up to give it a try. I want to try the powder too. I'm going to order a mini version of that. They didn't have none. Um, so we'll see how this goes. And I need to pack my Charlotte Tilbury. I only have a little bit of that left anyway, so. Um, Harper got this one. It's not the best thing I've ever smelled, but she likes it. I like her kind of half free game with her perfumes. Um, so she got this one. And then I picked up my little mini milk setting spray. And then I got a Tower 28 lip balm. That's what I have on now. It's actually really, really nice. You guys know I'm a lip balm junkie. And it just looks like this. It's so cute. And they have other colors. But yeah, I got that one. So it's kind of wearing off, but it's nice and hydrating. Decompress. I watched some Sex in the City, and so it's time for me to drop the kids off. And I'll be back because I'm over it. Still coming down strong. Hello, friends. We're back in Bertha, child. I stay in Bertha ever since I got Bertha. I feel like before, I didn't do as much stuff, and now I'm just always outside. But I feel like, I don't know, maybe it's because I'm, I don't know what's that about. Anyways, um, I'm currently on my way to my uncle's house because that's where my dad and stuff are, is. That's where my dad is. So I could drop the kids off to him. Um, right now I'm driving through Drexel and oh my gosh, I just, every time I come down here, one, I just love, I always tell you guys, I love University City. If you, anybody's ever visiting past Philly, I recommend to stay like in the University City area. Like if you like more of like a spaced out city vibe, just love it down here. Good food, like not too much in the city, but like you're in the city, you know what I'm saying? Cause like you could literally get downtown in like five minutes from here. But anyways, oh my God, it just reminds me of like me frolicking the class when Harper was little and stuff like that. But yeah, we're going there. I'm so tired. You guys know I'm still running on three hours of sleep. Enzo had took a nap and then I was gonna take a nap, but I was like, if I take a nap, I'm just, it's gonna be so hard for me to get up. So I got up and just did like the rest of the things on my to-do list. And then Harper fell asleep and I just was sitting there waiting for them to wake up so we could head out. But like I packed like the rest of my makeup, my new stuff I picked up today. Um, my curling iron, my toothbrush, all that type of stuff. That way it's done. Um, and that way I just need to close my suitcase when I leave. And then we went and picked up some boba. You finished? I got a, um, put that in the back, please. I got a Vietnamese um, iced coffee boba because I need to wake up. And if you ever need some energy and to get up, child, a Vietnamese coffee is the way to do it. So I picked that up and Harper got a milk tea boba that is demolished. But... Mine's is really good. It could use just a splash more condensed milk so it's sweeter. And I would have preferred extra ice because it's, it's like room temp right now. So it's not ice and it's not hot like weirdly in the middle. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's almost my birthday. Happy birthday to my cousin Tyler. However, however old he is. It's so crazy because my grandma, my Maya, her birthday is April 3rd. And then my aunt's birthday was yesterday. Oh, you didn't say happy birthday to Aunt Noe, did you? Oh my goodness. Her birthday was yesterday. And then today's my cousin's birthday. And then my birthday is on Sunday. So, like, April has always just been, like, a crazy month for me. And you guys know Harper's birthday is next week. My sister's birthday. It's just a lot going on in April. But guess what? You know why so many of us? Because people love them Aries, though like us Aries you can't escape it but yeah I'll see you guys in a little bit I'm gonna try to drink my coffee I mean I'm not that tired I just feel like my eyes are like I'm like if I close my eyes I'm gonna go to sleep but I'll see you guys in un momento. okay I'm home it's 12 20 I'm gonna sit here and I'm about to go to bed because I gotta be up at three um to be at the house to get to the airport by four because we leave at like five cents anyways um, I wanted to open my birthday gift for my dad and my stepmom with you guys, my bonus mom. Um, I asked for it specifically because there was something I've been wanting, but I just never, I don't know. I, every time I would go to buy it, I'm like, I don't need that. So I asked someone to get it for me for my birthday. Um, and it got here just on time for the trip. I just had to eat something because I didn't eat all day. And now I'm like ready to go to sleep. So they, I just took the ribbon off. I didn't even show you guys. They had wrapped it all pretty it had some organza is that two or organza and some twine i definitely wasn't expecting it to be gift wrapped i feel like a little kid getting christmas gifts this year um 
I'm just staying at my uncle's a little bit longer than I planned to, but it's okay. I'm home now. I'm showered. I got my outfit out. I just have to wake up, brush my teeth. I left my suitcase open because my toothbrush is in it. I can't find my travel toothbrush. And then close my suitcase and be out of here. I hate when businesses use this heavy duty string. I mean, tape. It has a string in it. Like, what the hell? Um, I'm so tired. I just got tired two seconds ago. Like once I hit the shower. But they got me a New York Yankees cap. But it's a designer version. Because you know me. I love a little razzle dazzle. And I was like, I want to start wearing hats. But... This is the perfect size. I was worried that if I got it small, a size down, which is what my head measures, that it would be too tight. It has a little bit of room on it, and I was, like, taking my hair into consideration. But, yeah, it's just super cute. And then on the side right here, it just has the brand. Do I know how to pronounce the brand? No. Am I going to watch it on YouTube? Yes. But, yeah, it's just a collab with them. Super cute, super fly, super special. So, yeah, thank you so much to them for getting this for me because I've been wanting it. I guess it was like, every time I would go to buy it, I was like, I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I might wear it in the airport tomorrow because I'd imagine that I'm going to look insane. Um, I need to get my thing out the closet really quick. But, yeah, thank you so much to them for sending this to me. Got to take all the stickers off, the tag. I be cringy when I see people with the price tag on their head. I be like, what the hell? But yeah, I like I don't usually like wearing hats because I don't like when they're tight. So I sized up on this one because I wanted space. Like I didn't I wanted it to be like I don't feel it. But if I would have sized down, that's where it starts to feel annoying. But I'm about to pop my retainer in. I'm about to turn off my TV. I'm about to put on my noise machine and I'm going to bed. I will see you guys at the airport. Or something like that. And then we're going to be in the yams. <laughs> I'm a hybrid Miami. Look at my Gucci daddies. Okay, bye. I'm going to sleep. I'm so tired. And those cheesesteak dumplings I just had. With the truffle parmesan fries. If I would have had a Sprite. Bitch. But I'm going to bed. Good night. We made it to the yams. We made it to the yams. Get it sexy. Get it sexy. Alright guys. We are locked and loaded. We just got to the room. I'm waiting for the bottle of honey to get here and then I think me and Steph will change and go lay by the pool. We're staying at the Mondrian in a two bedroom. Um, super cute, super cute, super cute, super cute. Um, where are we gonna lay by the pool? Cause that sun's coming out. Give me a little drinky drink or whatever. Look at the view guys. We're in the yams, we're in the yams. stuff are about to head to the pool we just got ready i put on a little bit of concealer over my spots i used the shape tape the hydrating one because it matches my skin tone and then that's it i set it um i'm wearing my hat again to protect my face from the sun but also because it's a look um wear my desi's amazon same bikini i love in aruba where's this from i got it from asos i think it's a weekday um my little canvas gucci tote my pants from Design, and then I have on Steph's Hermes slides because I don't want to wear my new ones yet. So my friend has these, and they're better anyways because they're not leather, so like the water won't mess them up. But yeah, we're about to head to the pool, so cue the montage. We're waiting for the bottle of alcohol to get here, but we're still going to drink downstairs. And let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, yeah, my money. <laughs> That's what liquor does to you. Let's start half. Scares me. Let's keep it classy. But this seems like a lot. Mm, 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 mm. The scent. Trip clubs and dollar bills. Still got my money. <laughs> I say happy birthday to you, to me. <laughs> Yeah. Let's go to the pool. Apparently, 
I can't bring my vlog camera. So I'm a vlog on the phone. So cue the vlog footage via iPhone 13. See ya. All right, my, my thing. Man. Your body drive me crazy. Your body need a license fit. Your body are too tight and neat. Anybody who got eyes can't see. She just wanna dance and tease. She just wanna dance and tease me. 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 Listen, you've been missing since 2006. starting my hair to put some curls in it. Luckily that the humidity is not eating me up for filth out here this time. Cause usually it'd be me against Miami. But I'm putting some curls in my hair really quick. And then I'm gonna do my makeup. So let's get ready for Zina. Let's get ready. Let's do it. I need my iPad so I was gonna say use it. <laughs> Dressed, but at this point, F it. We're about to take a shot real quick and head out. And I need to come back and reconvene about my eyelashes and get my shit together because I don't like brushing. I don't know how I was up and ended up brushing. Who put my toning in the sandwiches? Oh, and to double. <laughs> Alright, guys, we went to dinner. We're back. We're back at the the hotel i put my dress down because i can't function with the arm parts but we're back at the hotel we're about to just drink and figure out what our next move is for tonight before stephanie's boyfriend goes to sleep because it would not surprise me if he tried to fall asleep i was rushing so bad my eyelashes were not adhering they're probably a little wonky that one's wonky right there i could feel it i need to pull it off but we went to dinner we went to um where did we go because we had reservations, they have reservations for tomorrow, they've had them this whole time, but today we just were kind of winging it, so we, I just like booked the first thing I saw. Where did we go today for dinner? Bioli. Bioli, whatever. Um, we went there, they didn't have the performers that they used to have, but the food, I do not recommend. I heard like great things about it, um, but it wasn't my favorite thing ever. So what did we get? I got like the the shrimp basically just like on a skewer did not like it and I'm not saying you're not gonna like it I didn't like it because it was more of like curry based and I'm just not a curry type of girl like it's just not my spice preference so I didn't like that um I got some broccolini the broccolini was really good which I find was crazy because it's really hard for people to get broccolini right um her boyfriend got chicken the chicken skewers but there was no skewers and then he got spinach but the spinach had like peanut butter in it so nobody liked the spinach i didn't even taste it because spinach and peanut butter don't even go together for me and then um steph got sushi i blinked and steph's sushi was gone so i'm guessing steph's sushi was good but we got some drinks um and then we were going to go to playa and then they were like okay check your bags and they opened my bag they was like yeah you can't bring a camera in and I was like, y'all could take the camera for now. Like, I, was, I wasn't going to pull it out. Yeah, you still can't bring it. So we came back to the room for now. Um, me and Steph's feet were crying. She had on some YSL mules. I had on these Bottegas. And my toes was over it. So we're sitting here. We're about to drink. I don't know. Maybe we'll go back out. Maybe we won't. Who knows? Maybe we'll put on some sweatshirts and just walk around and get some hookah. Because her boyfriend won't even come out the room right now. That's snacking on chips. Anyway, I'm out here in Miami though. 
S I N G L E again. With my ratchet ass friends. That's a cute little cake. I love a little mini cake. Okay, so it's day one. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a little drunk. I'm a, I'm a little smizz. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not that smizz though. But anyways, it's my birthday. Happy birthday to me. And I want to say happy birthday to you, to you. And I want to say happy birthday to you. I really want to say thank you so much to my best friend and her boyfriend for not letting me spend my birthday being sad at home. They brought me to Miami. They've been showing me love. I love them so much. But we, first of all, we checked into the hotel. Steph, what time did we get this bottle of honey at two? We got this bottle of honey at 2 p.m., y'all. It's 12.33. It's a goner. It's a goner. And we all took naps. It's a goner. So me and Steph just put some comfortable clothes on because, baby, my feet is crying. Um, So we're about to, I don't know, what are we about to do? Are we going to go for a walk? Are we going to explore? Yeah. We're going to try to find, like, some hookah and, like, a little yeah, vibe. A little drinky drink. My friend got me a cake. Wait, I'm crying because I didn't know. And she was out here with me. And then Matt walked out of... Do you care if I say Matt's name? No. Oh, okay. Just ask me. Matt walked out of the hallway where the rooms were with the cake. <laughs> she was like, we got a sparkler, but there's no lighter. But it's the thought. Oh, my God. I know. She was laughing, uh, flashing the lights. I'm just so happy. I'm just so grateful for another year of life. You know, like, sometimes you never realize how many people don't have something as simple as this life right and you just see all these people dealing with so much i'm just so grateful and i just want to say thank you guys so much to all of you guys just for supporting me for being there for me and my kids and watching us grow it really is the most heartwarming thing ever and especially because i what i've been on youtube for like what like five years now yeah, yeah i think it's been like four or five years and like for you guys to just want to be there for us, it's mind boggling. So today's my 28th birthday, 28. She ate that. It's another year of life that I ate that. Um, just feeling blessed, feeling grateful, feeling highly favored, all of that. Um, you know, we had earthquakes, we got solar eclipses, but it's okay. Can't knock, can't knock me down, I'm an Aries. I can't knock a real one down. And look at my birthday gift. I won't wear it. This ring is smarter than me because every time I take a nap, it's in an app and it says, did you take a nap from this time? How did you know that? But I guess because my heart rate goes down. But yeah, we're about to go out. I'm not going to take the camera because the last place we went to said, you got a camera. So just for precaution. Who's the best friend ever? Happy birthday to me. Oh, oh, oh. A good up friend. All right, we'll see you guys later. Oh, okay. <laughs> I told you stop doing it. <laughs> That's that old people. That's that old people stuff. I can't even do that. <sighs> we just got back to the room. We went to a little speakeasy. They gave me two shots of tequila and I've been drinking honey, but it's okay. Yes, it was so cute in there. I would definitely go back. Highly recommend. If they had some hookah, oh, bitch. It's okay. I didn't really need a large, so. They're not talking. She gave me 80. I said, I said my sister's going to hate me. I said, if my sister doesn't have rent, she gets really mad. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's my birthday. Ah, oh, I'm just laying on my hair. Clipping hair. Good morning, guys. I'm like tired, but I'm up because I'd rather sleep by the pool and then in the bed because I can sleep in the bed at home, you know? Oh, my body hurt. It's a day. And I've been up for a little bit. I've been up since like eight. Oh, that's not a good angle. I'm about to think about to put a bikini on and then find something to eat. And then 
go by the pool and take a nap. Cause I'm tired. <sighs> what little abby abs hurt. Having a king size bed is so fun. I can't wait to move and sleep in mine. Cause why am I laying sideways? I ain't laying in this bed the right time the whole time I've been here. All right, guys, we're going to go to Webster. We were going to go to the pool, but I actually want to get a shirt and some glasses. Or buy myself something nice for my birthday because it's my birthday. Um, every time I hang my arm over the thing, I just scare. But I changed my outfit to go there because I did not pack clothes to wear the same thing all day because it's my birthday. So let me show you guys my fit of the day. I'm going to try to film a little TikTok. Um, where am I gonna put the camera? Is that so new? Never had a bitch like me in your life. Alright, my OOTD of the day of the day. Well, Nike tennis skirt that I was supposed to wear at Aruba. So cute. The bruise, we don't know how it got there. We love her though. Um, my one filter tank is from Local European. And then I have on my Chapraise. My feet are crying and I didn't even leave yet. Because baby, those Bottegas yesterday, I just do not wear heels anymore. My feet hurt. But, and then I have on my en route cross. Can someone call Miss Colleen and tell Miss Colleen that we want the en route cross necklace as a regular chain that's small like this, like 16 inches, nothing, nothing major. But when I want to wear it like this, because I love the design, I just wear the cross on the back. I just be having a cross float into my back, and that's okay. Where my boutique is, as, any, as always, that's why I need to buy some new glasses. And I'm gonna carry my little Fendi, and I'm gonna try to get me a little matcha as some a Joe the Juice or something for the plot to take a photo as a prop. Do it for the plot. That's it. And then we come back and we'll put my bathing suit back on. Stephanie had to rig me into my bikini, so I had to take it off ever so politely so I can put it back on. Um, Steph is sitting here being the old lady that she is doing scratch offs in miami i'm not trying to witness an extra day <laughs> you're gonna crawl out of work <laughs> i'm trying not to go back to work <laughs> new day new bottle of henny new day new henny new henny dog raw our guy is done our guy is getting his content in <laughs> huh Yes, my guy gonna get his content in. And he does it so like sly, it's hilarious to me. <laughs> Three dollars, that girl might be a bite. I didn't do nothing yet. What he say? Somewhere. Let's go shopping. I'm in London. I like to go and shop at the mall, shop at the Prada, shop at the store, shop in the drop and stop in Dior. Louis ah. Vuitton, cover my toes, throw my trousers, look at my bricks. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look at my shoes, look at my shoes. <laughs> Come hot socks and sandals, man's outside in crocs and shambles. Please, quick talk, no rambo. Soon as they send their bread, I cancel. I like the tango, twisting and tangled, testing the angles. Up in the bank though, I got the singles. You with the same hoes, I like the bankroll. Pricey, pricey, pricey. He wanna fuck cause I'm icy. He never met no one like me. It's pretty funny how now they all like me. In it, this ain't rent it. Straight from the plane, I bought it. Maybe you can't afford it. I'm on my dogs and we out in shortage. Shortage, shortage. Shortage, you got a shortage on your funds And I got a long clip on my guns mm. Sounds like fun, I got no shortage, I'm no bum Reach for my person, you're done Reach for the purses <laughs> Wearing designer, I'm in the future I got a future, I'm in a new truck I'm in a booth, y'all drink a kombucha mm. Singing with Smiley, speaking me highly Trying to go curry, right, we're about to go to dinner We're about to go to Poppy State let me show you my outfit. So I was supposed to wear my Jacqueline's dress and I'm bloated. I'm so bloated. So it wouldn't zip up all the way. I was just gonna take a picture and it, but run, running late now. So I had to revamp. I had to I had to take the drawing board. Mind you, I didn't bring options like I brought what I needed. So let's look at tonight's fit. These leggings from Rue Shop. I've had these for years. Never worn because they're just spicy, like it's getting Miami. 
I'm wearing my clear Aquazoras. And then, funny story, I didn't bring a shirt for this. And I went shopping today to find a shirt. I couldn't find one. This is actually Steph's boyfriend's shirt. Shout out to my bro. It's so cute. It matches perfectly. There's a design on the back. And because it's men's, I just cuffed the sleeves and tucked one side. And I, I was looking for an oversized tee anyways to balance the bottom because I wasn't trying to give Hofa show. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to give spice. I'm looking for the whole shit. My bad. Huh? You said what happened? Right, what you say about them? I said what you Sir, is this the right car? It is the right car. <laughs> That's a big ass car. <sighs> Changing your outfit. Ugh. Oh, shit. This is a nice car. She she didn't see this coming go. She probably like what the heck. Hello. Yeah, like, like pressed them out there and leave it. <laughs> I gotta go back to the hotel. I'm crying. How are you still out there that whole time? When it came and went beeps. Yeah, what did you wait for? The car. People really be coming out here with no, like, I come, imagine people be like me, like, right now, I got no That's how Jamisha, I told you, Jamisha slept on a bench before. I told you that. No, but she's up on a bench literally outside though. Like that's if, if people saw her. How far is I'm looking for the. I gotta start bringing my speaker to these. Wait, so add the stop to go back. So can we all work? No, wait. That's it. Are you sure? Excuse me, sir. Hello, sir. If, He's looking to wait for you to see what you're gonna say. Um, if we just can we add a stop to go back and say we're just grabbing one thing. Could you wait for us outside and we can add a stop to go back to the hotel, or no? No, 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 compression. Huh? Eh, no compression English. Oh, oh. ¿qué le puedo decir? Podemos <laughs> agregar una parada para porque solo vamos a comprar una cosa. Entonces puede esperarnos un minuto y, y agregamos la parada para para atrás para el hotel o no? Claro. Oh, see? Okay, muchas gracias. <laughs> Good thing you speak Spanish, girl. Chatterbox over here. We came to get a we came to get a bottle of honey because we ran out of honey. A bottle a day keeps the haters away. We needed the whole trip. <laughs> Meanwhile, we probably drank that. <laughs> what is this? What is that? That's scary. Oh. <laughs> Thank God Steph talks Spanish, because if it wasn't for the babes, we would be S-O-L. Back home. We made it back home. It's our last night in Miami. All right, guys. BRB. Me and Steph are going to Playa. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. We'll see what the vibes are. I gotta go. I gotta go. Secretly, I'm fried. I just got out of the shower. I'll see you guys tomorrow. We're going to go home tomorrow. Excuse me, I had a burp. We're going home tomorrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm tired, boss. I'm I got half an eyelash on. I'm tired, boss. I'm tired. Oh my god, the camera's on 11%. I feel like my eyes. I have a lazy eye. I think I put my lash on wrong on this eye. Because it's giving not the same eye. But that's okay because we're just going home. Anyways, today's the last day. We're about to go to the pool, get some sun, last minute sun for the vibes. Um, I was packing. Oh, I hate packing on the last day. I oh, work everything in a suitcase. But yeah, we're going home. We have one bottle of, I need to finish, one bottle of gasoline. Um, last night, hysterical. Funny stuff last night. We went to fly last night. Why? Listen, we went to Playa last night. Let me just tell y'all how a hookah at Playa was $150. And then like coals weren't even, like refills weren't included. I was like, that's insane. But the, the hookah was good. I got some love 66 and I was vibing. I was vibing. Um, but yeah, we're getting ready to go. I'm hungry. I need to eat. I need some water preferably. Last night, just was a, like tears coming out my eyes last night. 
good tears. But I had such a fun birthday trip. 